All right, homies. So today we're going to go through with the pipette cleaning. As always, set your pipette to max, which in this case is a thousand. Always wear gloves and keep your ethanol on hand. Since the Gilson and Finn pipettes are pretty much the same in assembly and disassembly, we're just going to go through with the Gilson real quick. So first off, you got to come over here and take off your ejector. Set that to the side. Come grab this nut securing the barrel. Slowly twist that off, but watch for the spring which will pop. Slowly take the nut off. Then remove the barrel. Take out the spring assembly and watch for an O-ring in smaller pipettes. Grab your cam wipe. Grab your cam wipe. Grab your cam wipe. Right here, you want to look down the barrel of your pipette. Make sure there's no goop or debris. If there is, go ahead and give it a little spritz of ethanol. You can use as much ethanol as necessary right here. Give it a wipe. Feel free to give, be aggressive here. Take another look. Grab your spring assembly. Pull back. Look for any rust or corrosion. If you have an O-ring, check that now for any wear and tear. Double check the spring for springiness. Look down the actual pipette. Check for any debris here. If there is any, give it a, fr give it a little wipe with uh, some ethanol. Take a good look at it. So for reassembly, we're just going to put everything back in in the reverse order that we took it apart. Just make sure you double check everything. Alright, once again, double check for corrosion or rust. Put the spring assembly followed by the barrel. Reattach everything with the nut. Just twist that back on there. All right, we're gonna take a second to make sure the dial still works. So we can give that a couple turns. Now we'll set it back to a thousand. Once that's done. Once that's done, we'll just reattach the ejector, push that back into place. And just like that, you got it done. All right, so here we got the Eppendorf Research Pipette, slightly different. Once again, make sure your volume set to max, which is a thousand. So we're gonna slide off this outer shaft, check that funny debris. Grab this inner core and just give that a hard twist. Slowly screw that out. Check the actual pipette for any debris. Here you have two slits, which going to pinch into these. To release it, watch out for the spring which pops off with some force. Check the barrel for any debris. If you have some debris, use ethanol and a chem wipe to wipe it off. Now we're going to look at the spring assembly and same thing. Look for damage, corrosion, or some gunk. If there's anything there that you can wipe off with ethanol and a chem wipe, do so now. Here you have all the pieces. So for reassembly, we're going to attach this core back into the inner barrel. Make sure this slides back into the slit. Now we're going to take this and twist it back into the pipette. Make sure it's nice and snug. Reattach the outer shaft. Once we do that, we're done. 